season again in mid-Missouri. And before you get the first bite of the year, we have some safety information and details on the illnesses you should be on the lookout for. ABC 17's Dana Clemens talked to a doctor today about how serious tick bites are so far this year. And Dana, he's already had to remove quite a few ticks. Marissa, he has, but he said it seems to be about on par with the average amount for this time of year. The good news, he's seen very few tick-borne illnesses. And the reason why may surprise you. Just the thought of a little parasitic creature crawling on you and embedding itself into your skin can be enough to ruin your day. Then add the tick-borne illnesses the bites can cause. The big thing that we have here in Boone County is ehrlichiosis. That's the one that we probably worry about the most uh, because there's a fairly high rate of that in the Boone County ticks. Ehrlichiosis is a curable disease that feels much like the flu. But there is good news. The vast, vast majority of the time, it's just a local inflammatory reaction. It's just, you know, a red area and it itches and sometimes it gets a little sore, but there's, really, there's no infection. That's because it may take longer than you expect to sicken you. A tick has to be on for like six hours uh, minimum before you can have transmission. So Dr. Jason Zare tells me as long as you remove the tick quickly, you should be fine. But there is one disturbingly important thing to keep in mind. If it's messed with and is embedded, will regurgitate what it has into the body. That increases the risk of infection. So that's why you don't want to mess with it. You just want to grab, pull slowly and surely and just get them off. Dr. Zara tells me the best way to remove a tick is to use tweezers and to slowly pull the whole thing out. He also suggests taking your clothes off before you get inside and putting them directly in the wash and then checking your body for ticks. Thanks, Dana. Dr. Zara tells us he hasn't had any cases of Lyme disease where the tick came from mid-Missouri.